So here it is, welts are not the best ones but I'm pretty happy with it, uh, I'm gonna be making some mounts for it on the back, some brackets and finish it up. Alright, so here's the gas tank, I'm pretty happy with it for being the first one, to be honest, um, like I said I need to drill a um, hole up here for the airflow, but uh, it's pretty good, it doesn't leak or anything, it has the fuel line uh, was there and yeah I'm pretty happy with it oh, so I welded these uh, spacers for the bearings for the um, jack shaft side which is gonna be behind this thing there was no much space here for anything like I couldn't bolt the um, bearings to this so I came up with that solution, I think it's going to be good. I will, I will weld the spacer to the frame and then that way I'll be able to you know, take, take it out um, if I need to change the gear or, or whatnot. They usually go underneath the engine, so this time what I'm gonna be doing is cutting the longest I can and then twist them all the way to the to the side and then try to make one like this somehow. I'm gonna be cutting here so I can have the longest the longest pieces to work with and I don't know if these ones are together, if these ones are together, I'm not sure, I'm gonna have to open it and check it.
Okay, so I make a little jig for the gas pedal. I cut a little plate, drill the hole, put a sleeve on it, and then for the pedal, I drill a hole on a bolt, and then you can remove it pretty easily just by taking this nut. And then I just need to add a, a beefy spring here. But we got gas. I built this bracket for the back and only brake I'm gonna be having. Um, build it up of, I made it of um, quarter inch plate, which I wanted a little bit beefy because I don't wanna die. So then I made this, then I used this nut and washer as a spacer for now till I'll find the proper spacer here or I make it but for now so I can tuck it in and weld it into the frame okay so I'm gonna finish the video here just cause uh, I need a hub for the back wheel which I don't have it I'm gonna have to go buy it or maybe go to a friend's house uh, fabricate it. I'm not sure yet. Um, so yeah, I just wanna do it properly. Uh, next next video, we'll have it up and running for sure. And it'll be fun. Also back here, that's gonna be the next build, which is a race go-kart, 125cc, 30 horsepower. Uh, I'm gonna be putting that engine into this into this super it's gonna be the fastest shop rider um, not sure how I'm gonna be doing it uh, I'm gonna have to be building a frame for it for sure um, I haven't taken it apart yet as you can see but yeah, I think this thing is gonna rip. It'll be super, super fast. Probably the the pipe sticking out from the back or something like, it's gonna be insane. So yeah, this is it. Um, stay tuned for next video. And uh, thank you very much for watching. Bye.